Brennan was a guy we, we targeted early in the draft in the, in the process just from an impress us off of film. He's a, you know, he's a big man. He's got long arms. I mean, two big things you look for. He's got pretty, he's a really a pretty, pretty good athlete. I'm, and from that standpoint, but uh, really liked his play style. Thought he fit what we did. He's uh, he's aggressive. He's a finisher. He's really a pretty physical player, just as he is, and uh, very 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 active, which is uh, something we really value around here. So uh, liked him right from the start, and uh, excited to get him where we did. Uh, as far as his shoulder went, uh, he missed the last four games of the year with the torn labrum, had surgery for it. Um, at the combine, he, w he wasn't able to participate, but uh, did was able to do everything and was cleared medically by, uh, by his doctors and, and did a workout and feel pretty good about that. So we feel good. As far as uh, where he fits into our plans, I mean, he'll come in, he'll compete initially at the right right spot we've got kind of a up in the air situation with Derek Newton being injured we're not quite sure when he'll be able to come back uh, Ryan Harris probably figures into the mix a little bit so we'll put Brendan in there right off the bat and compete and we can only get better through that competition he talked about uh, we just talked about, talked about uh, he has an aggressiveness and a mean streak and he kind of alluded to that he, have you, did you see that on film can you talk about that a little bit more yeah, you, you do see it on film. He's uh, like I said, that's what that's what I mean by finisher. He's a finisher. Uh, you know, you, you see all kinds of guys all along the line. Some, some are perfectly content to keep their guy out of the play, and as long as that happens and that that's the baseline, then they're they're pretty happy. And this, uh, Brennan li likes to put people in the ground, wear them out over the course of a game, and uh, he did it. Fairly consistently, and it's it makes makes it fun to watch college film that way. <laughs> so he he is a physical player and, and an aggressive player, and uh, so th that is definitely one of his positive attributes. What kind of advantages do players have that have a parent or dad? Play in the uh, in the NFL. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't know about his mother. Uh, no, I I think it's. I I think it's got to be an advantage not not having a parent who played myself. I'm not exactly sure. I th I think they've got to come into the situation a little more grounded and a little more aware of what to expect. You know, I think that would be the one thing. And and even you know, not just from uh, the initial shock, but the the preparation and the work and how much of a profession it is at this level. And so I, I think that would be the biggest advantage from that standpoint. Did he play the right side? He did. He played the right tackle. So that should make it so much easier for him. I'm sorry? Should the transition be a lot easier because of that? Yeah. Did they play some of the schemes that you, the scheme that you played? It's, uh, it's uh, I can't, I mean, I don't, I don't know them to be a follower of our scheme, but, you know, they ran some wide zones and that type of thing that, uh, that we ran. So, so it, it does fit into that, which is, uh, so, but he is on the right side, and so it should be a fairly, he should be fairly comfortable with the initial footwork and those type of things. And of course, it just plays out, as with all, you know, if he, if he comes out and wins the position outright, great. If not, he's got to learn to play left, too. That's how it works. So, <laughs> it was, we'll, be, we'll be working from both sides in, in that angle right fairly quickly. Maybe not focusing on swinging left to right or vice versa, but, uh, but at some point we'll have to work towards that.